How many mechanical devices have we used today? Did you ride a bike or open a can or even cut some paper? More than likely, you have used at least one, if not more devices in a day. All of these will require some kind of motion. By the end of this video, you should be able to identify, name, and give some examples to be able to describe these motions. So grab yourself a pen and some paper and let's get to it. Welcome back to Design and Technology On Demand. My name is Charlotte and I make weekly videos helping you to succeed in your Design and Technology GCSE. I just want to say a massive thank you to anybody that has already hit that subscribe button. If you haven't already, it's absolutely three and it does help to support my channel's growth. So in a world of mechanics, there are four main key motions. Each of these motions do move in a slightly different way and are achieved using slightly different mechanical means. Let's find out more. The four primary types of mechanical motions are Linear, reciprocating, rotary, and oscillating. Starting with linear. Linear is the motion that moves an object in one dimensional motion along a straight line from its starting point. Reciprocating is a motion that pivots back and forth or up and down in a linear motion. It is a cycle of two opposite motions back and forth. Rotary motion turns the object in a complete 360 degree circle around an axis, often repeated. Oscillating is a motion that repeats itself. It is a combination of rotary and reciprocating motion that is offset from the axes and rotates back and forth in an arc motion. Examples of these motions. We have established that linear moves in a straight line. That moves in a straight line like a train moving down a track, a sliding door within a frame, a firing of a bullet, an apple free falling from a tree, a child sliding down a slide or riding a bicycle. And rotary moves in a circle. A good example is a wheel or a fan where reciprocating is something that goes back and forth in a linear motion. Examples would be a piston, a pump, a power hacksaw blade, or even a sewing machine. Where oscillating is a movement that goes back and forth in a curved swing. A swing will be pushed and cover the same distance until it returns where no force is being applied. A clock pendulum will equally to and fro, and a bird will flap its wings back and forth. So what are the key takeaways of this video? The four key motions are linear, reciprocating, rotary and oscillating. Linear is a straight line like a train. Reciprocating is back and forth and up and down like a piston. Rotary moves in a circle like a wheel. Oscillating is a curved back and forth swing like a clock pendulum. Let's end the video with a question. Make sure you put your answers in the comment box below. What are the four primary motions? If you found value within this video, then please do hit that like and subscribe button to help support my channel's growth. You may also want to check out some of my other videos linked in the description box. See you in the next video.